Hello everyone, how are you? I do hope that you are okay. Welcome back to the crazy project where I am mining the entire world. You might wonder, what am I doing on the nether? Well, I have been killing wither skeletons and now I have 10 wither skeleton skulls. This is enough to summon 3 withers, which means that to sum to the beacon that we already have, we can now start working with four beacons that that's going to be very cool because then i don't need to move the beacon so much which i hope that it improves my efficiency now i think i have some soul sand in the surface but i am not sure so actually i should go and search a little bit for it and then i will see you back on on the overworld and we are going to summon and kill the withers Okay, look, I, I thought I had more soul sand. I only have actually 12 and I need a little bit more, but that's not a problem. The soul sand valley actually is not in that portal, it's the one near the, the zombie spawner. What I actually need to do, well, revolves a little bit around that area, so I might go there anyway. So, um, what do we also need to do on this episode? You see, to fly around, I need rockets and this is the last of rockets that I have. The gunpowder, it, it's okay, I can kill a couple of creepers, that's fine, but the sugar canes, I usually add a farm down there in the zombie spawner and uh, yeah, I, I don't have one right here, so what I need to do now that I don't go to the zombie spawner that much, if I want to keep uh, a steady supply of sugarcane is to do a sugarcane farm over here. So, I need to go there anyway to go and get the soul sand, so I will also bring a little bit of sugarcane with me and do a farm here on the surface. That, that should also be good. Ah, look, 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 after draining the aquifer, we now have this cave exposed to the surface. That's, that's so great. I, I didn't came here for so long because now I don't repair the tools using the spawner, but I, I didn't even notice that this cave is the same cave that I was exposing. Oh, can you imagine when we remove all of that? <laughs> oh man, it's going to look so cool. Uh, anyway, now that I am down here, what I do need to do is to bring some sugarcane. I cannot forget that, so that should actually be the first thing that I do. So we came here and we bring this. I don't mind to, to leave uh, another sugarcane farm over here. Maybe it is helpful, maybe it is not. But uh, at least I need to do and uh, take a lot of sugarcane to be able to do a surface one. So uh, this is the first step. Uh, 48, that, that should be fine. That should be okay. Now, in these chests, do I have a little bit more of soul sand? Uh, no and no. So yeah, I, I do really need to go to the nether. I miss the zombie spawner. I truly miss you. I spent so much time over here repairing the tools before having the villagers on the surface that, yeah, the, this feels like an homecoming or something. It's great to see you. Anyway, uh, let me actually store these over here just to be sure that I don't lose them because it's quite annoying to get them. And uh, yeah, let, let's go to the nether and get some soul sand. Alright, now that we are back on the surface, actually I think the first thing we should do is the sugarcane farm because, ah, why not, it's so easy to do that, to be honest, let's just take that out of the way before we do uh, the actual cool stuff and kill the wither. Uh, what do I need? I need water, I should have a couple of buckets over here, yes I do. So what I'm going to do is actually expand this thing over here. Oops, <laughs> is to expand this thing over here. How am I going to expand this thing? Uh, fairly simple. Uh, this is going to be a row of water, so we do this until here, or um, ah, maybe until here. So uh, we remove this, and we do this. Yeah, um, then this will be a row of water. Uh, then, no, no, wait, wait, this one actually can be like this, dirt, like that, that's perfect. Then what else do we need? This needs to be a row of water, then we have two, then we have one and one. Yeah, this should be good. Now at some point the hole is going to come into this direction, so what I do need to do is already protect a little bit the perimeter so I know exactly where I can, where I should and where I should not mine. 
So we are going to do an enclosure out of tip slate, then everything is going to be marked, everything is going to be good. In the middle rows, because I need this to be waterlogged, I'm just going to simply place slabs, and then in these slabs, again, I, I will waterlog them, and yeah, uh, then what I just need to do is to place the sugarcane. Then, yeah, we have a functioning sugarcane farm that is will going to be able to support our rocket needs. Uh, yeah, so uh, allow me to finish this and then, uh, yeah, then let's go to the withers. Okay, good. Uh, what we just need to do is to wait that the sugarcanes uh, grow and then we can harvest them. Now, in order to kill the wither, I am going to bring the skulls and the soul sands to the end. Uh, in order to go to the end, I think that the stronghold is on that direction. I don't entirely remember, but I think we needed to pass a savannah village and then it was in the middle of the ocean. But, uh, well, anyway, uh, I will figure it out. Luckily, I left it marked because other way, <laughs> I don't know if I was going to find this. Okay, we need to go in this direction, we pass to a spawner, if I am not mistaken, there is a spawner somewhere around here. Uh, yes, there we go, but we just keep going, and ouch, ouch, then we, we keep going a little bit more, and there we go, we are in the end room, and there we go, uh, time to go to the end and kill the wither. I think I have a killing chamber over here from the first time that we did this, yes I do, so I do hope that this still works, because this is the easiest way to kill the wither that I know, and, uh... Yeah, it should work. Now the wither will explode and then it will start suffocating. Let's see. Yes, there we go. Super easy to kill it. Now I will just kill him. I will pick up the nether star and I just need to do this two more times to get two more nether stars and uh, yeah, then you can go and do the beacons. Alright, time to make the beacons. We do this. We got three extra beacons and eh. The ores are not a problem, I have already mined so much that, yeah, I, I have no problems with the ores. So, with the sunset, we will just ignite our new found beacons. And yeah, it was another episode that was basically uh, an improvement in terms of the efficiency that I do expect to have forward. So... Uh, there you go, this is what I do in the back office of the huge mining hole, so uh, yeah, I do hope that you have enjoyed, I really, really hope so, and uh, yeah, I really hope to see you on the next one.